this problem from complex number and the problem is if 2 cos theta this is equal to t we have to prove that 1 plus cos 7 theta by 1 plus cos theta this is t q minus t square minus 2t plus 1 whole square okay in this type of problem where 2 cos theta is given or 2 sin theta is given we first take x this is equal to cos theta plus i sin theta and we know that by using de Moivre's theorem 1 by x this is given by cos theta minus i sin theta we directly write this result and adding this two we get 2 cos theta this is equal to x plus 1 by x okay and if we take the nth power of this we get x to the power n this is equal to cos n theta plus i sin n theta and 1 by x to the power n this is cos n theta minus i sin n theta and getting the result x to the power n by 1 by x to the power n this is equal to 2 cos n theta okay so we write the left hand side by using this result and using this result we get 1 plus cos 7 theta is given by 1 plus this is given by x to the power 7 plus 1 by x to the power 7 by 2 because cos 7 theta this is equal to half into x to the power 7 plus 1 by x to the power 7 and this by 1 plus cos theta so it can be written as 1 plus half into x plus 1 by x right and by calculating we directly write here half and half from numerator and denominator taking common and cancel out we get the result as x to the power 7 whole square plus 2 into x to the power 7 plus 1 and in the lower term we get x square plus 2x plus 1 so we get the result as x to the power 7 plus 1 whole square by x plus 1 whole square okay now we know that the formula of algebra this is a to the power a to the power 7 plus b to the power 7 this is a plus b into this is a to the power 6 minus a to the power 5 into b plus a to the power 4 into b square and so on to b to the power 6 and using the same formula here we write this is x plus 1 whole square into this is given by x to the power 6 minus x to the power 5 plus x to the power 4 minus x is q plus x is square minus x plus 1 whole square by this is x plus 1 whole square and this x plus 1 square this x plus 1 square cancel out okay and here we make a small mistake here we get when we taking LCM we get 1 by x to the power 7 and in the lower portion we get 1 by x okay then 1 by x to the power 6 remains here so we write 1 by x to the power 6 okay now we taking common x is q from the upper portion we get the result as x to the power 6 when we write outside of square and this is given by x is q minus x is square plus x minus 1 plus 1 by x minus 1 by x square plus 1 by x is q whole square by this is x to the power 6 also and this x to the power 6 this x to the power 6 cancel out now we write in symmetrical form as x is q plus 1 by x is q minus this is x square plus 1 by x square this term and this term write together plus x plus 1 by x minus 1 
whole square. Now we write here the formula of a cube plus b cube, a square plus b square. We get the result as this is x plus 1 by x whole cube minus 3 into x plus 1 by x because a b is cancelled out because x into 1 by x. This is the first term. Second term is a square plus b square. This is given by x plus 1 by x whole square and this is minus so plus 2. Okay. Now this is minus x plus 1 by x. This is not minus. This is plus and this is minus whole square. Clear? And now putting the value of x plus 1 by x this is equal to t because it is given that t this is equal to 2 cos theta okay we put here this is t cube minus 3 t minus t square plus 2 plus t minus 1 and this whole square so we get the result as t cube minus t square plus 2t plus 1 whole square okay and clearly t cube minus t square plus 2t plus 1 whole square this is the right side of this expression. So we very easily prove this expression is equal to t cube minus t square minus 2t plus 1 whole square. Okay, this is the complete proof of this problem. Thank you. Thank you for watching.